Hello everyone, my name is Ian, welcome back to my hobby YouTube channel in brief book and film reviews. So today I'm going to give you a, a review of a book that I just finished up reading there. It's actually uh, The Litigators by John Grisham. Um, just finished this book up at the moment, I'm just here in Cologne, Germany. And I wanted to come online and just give this uh, review to the, to the book. I just finished it up uh, there last night. So had a nice day, came back, wanted to do this and that for you guys and that. So, um, yeah, so this book is a 2011 uh, legal crime thriller book by uh, the king, the master teller himself, John Grisham. And overall, this I think this is one of his 25 overall novel books about um, you know crime thrillers. This one is a bit more lighthearted than the, the most ones that have came, the previous ones that came along. And this would be uh, about 13, yeah, 13 years uh, since it first was published and that. And this came out on the 25th of the of October 2011. And it's basically about a small bouquet, bouquet um, kind of law, law, law firm, it's two guys and a secretary, um, who get the help of a, a Harvard graduate, um, college graduate, um, who is uh, basically ends up fighting with them against his old firm and a big huge um it's like a um kind of a it's a law case of cholesterol cholesterol drugs called cryox and um there's been many deaths and stuff like that you know within within this drug and stuff like that they're trying to bring a case against the the uh the big pharmaceutical company and stuff and that um it takes a lot of twists and turns as it goes on without spoiling fear or i have to say that this book is really really well written it's got a lot of humor and it reminds you a little bit of um like a film that i've seen before that you would have guys would have been uh would have seen also on that um i'm sure um and yeah it's a really really excellent film so it's got some really good characters with the one particular character that I like in it is, is Wally, one of the one of the um one of the, uh, the uh, one of the guys who works for the for, for the firm, the legal firm, and uh, he's a bit of a, a player or at least I think that he's a player and he and uh, John Gresham's ability to bring everyone and every char character's life um everyone and every character within the books personality out within the book is a uh, very masterful and stuff and uh, it, it did say that this is probably one of of um of few of his books that actually should be uh, or could be brought into like a film and stuff and i have to say i really agree I really agree this is tailor made for, for it so uh, it starts off uh, with the the law form uh, the, the the boutique law form struggling at the start and that you know the um the two guys and the secretary um gives the details about their lives and stuff and how they're struggling and how they reach kind of like uh, the lowest and low when they're trying to get rich from um, a masterful uh, plot to um try and take down um this big pharmaceutical company and that every law every kind of like uh, law forms uh, dream i suppose and that would be the would be the best case to hit you know to, to try and get financially well off from it you know stable and that you know lawyers are obviously and solicitors they have uh, an annual income and that uh, they might get bonuses they might get um a, a big huge case that kind of propels the, the, them as a solicitor a lawyer or the company and also generates a lot of income for the for the business and that for their particular firm and stuff and that but this is like the one it's all about a pharmaceutical company that makes billions so uh, they're in it for the millions and the money and uh, it's very uh, very humorous within it but also very detailed as well it's a very detailed book and that and it goes into it, it goes into the stories and it's a bit hard felt as well when we talk about the cases there's definitely it's definitely a lawyer feel about it when you talk i mean um obviously at some point in their lives everyone's probably needed a solicitor or a lawyer or in their lives and you can just sense that uh, John Grisham is has probably been allowed has probably been around sisters and lawyers most of his life and knows the ins and outs read up and read up on on cases and stuff to kind of put it, it put in um in his books and stuff and all in all I have to say this is a really really excellent book and one that I thoroughly enjoyed reading and uh, I, I definitely recommend it to anyone who wants to read a novel of late that hasn't come across this particular one obviously John is very well uh, known um in the book writing circles and uh, very well 
respect in that song. I'm sure that a lot of people would have come across um, some of these books before, but I definitely recommend this one. I think it's an excellent book on that, you know, John Gresham, The Litigators. Um, I don't want to go. I don't want to go too much on about it um, and spoil it for you. But I think it's a really good book that you should. Um, there's a lot of twists, uh, twists and turns on it. There's a lot of backstabbing and other stuff on it. It's kind of. But he also John gives so much character, and he also also gives so much uh, humor into it. And that it's a, it's a magical book and that. So that's my um, book review for this week and, uh, and I'm trying to get them out as much as, as quickly as possible but I'm also busy a lot so I don't get a chance to get them out as much as I would I'd like to get them on the day each week you know like on a Wednesday or something and that but it's not always possible but I, I will try and get to um, get them out as, qu as quickly as possible for you and that uh, I'd also like to thank all the subscribers as well 390 I looked there the other day 390 subscribers I never thought in a million years I'd probably get that you know like I was I was <laughs> I knew thought I'd only get about 25 subscribers, 20 subscribers and that. And when I got up to about 50, 60, I was like, okay, see if we get 100, see if we get 100. So now I'm up to 390 and that, you know, it's just like phenomenal and that, you know. Uh, maybe you guys just feel sorry for me, you just feel subscribers, but, but listen, it's nice anyway and that, you know, to know that your, your uh, reviews are being watched and stuff and that. Um, I always try to throw in something uh, for everyone within my reviews and stuff and that, you know whether it be for listening to music, CD reviews and stuff, uh, film reviews, different types of genres and also book reviews and stuff and that. Um, I used to be really into the um, autobiographies and I try and get into novels as well so people can relate to it. And uh, like not everyone likes the, the novels, not everyone likes it, uh, rock music or whatever but there's always something there for someone to just tap on and maybe have a listen and stuff and that and take a bit of time out from the usual stuff that you might be watching on YouTube and that. And uh, yeah, I don't encourage anyone to, um, um, you know, start on YouTube channel because we all have something to offer and that, you know, as a, whether you're doing it um, to uh, make money or uh, promote a business or something or you're doing it like yourself just for, uh, as a hobby and stuff and that uh, once a week and that, you know, to get a general interest and be part of uh, the YouTube community. Anyway, uh, I'll let you go. Uh, have a wonderful week. It's a... Uh, Today, today. It's a Wednesday today and that so have a wonderful week and that and uh, peace upon you always. All the best, take care. Sign up boy.